After five years, I returned to get the Platinum Trophy in Crash Bandicoot. It broke me back then, and after all this time, I thought I would be better, but... Oh, god damn! Oh, oh, nailing it. Oh, come on, son. No! Oh, god damn! Bullshit. Bullshit. Let's begin. So here we are. Crash Bandicoot. Have I been staring at this screen for over 20 minutes? Yes. Have I been wondering why am I playing this game? Yes. One main reason why I am actually returning to this game, and here it is. So the real reason why I'm actually playing this game is because Emily recently acquired PlayStation 5 and has been playing Crash Bandicoot. And as you can see, she had 72% completion on Crash Bandicoot, 81%, and I'm rocking a, a solid 29%, which is just cannot stand, can it? Um, having someone who doesn't play video games, hasn't played them for a long time, be better than you and remind you that she has all the trophies that you don't have. That's a real reason. Well, that's a great fucking start, isn't it? I had a moment's panic, but I actually didn't lose my original save file. I last played this game back in 2017 and I had 11 of the 24 trophies on the base trophy list. But more importantly, Crash Bandicoot is only one of 14 games I haven't managed to 100% on my account. This means it's bringing down my overall completion percentage quite a lot. And I started Crash with a 99.04% completion on my trophy list. And I was really excited to see how this will increase from just this one game. Okay, let's just do some crashing. Let's do some bandicooting. Okay, all right, okay. Jump over that. This map is so just on top of you. I don't like it. I don't like that. And there's the first death of their crash. Living, living large. So the first part of my plan at Platinum was literally just to beat the game and relearn the mechanics because it's been a while and if you've ever played Crash before, you know it can be very difficult. Oh, I did a level. Oh, nice. That'll take me some Wumper. Victory Wumper. Sign me up for that, please. Well, I missed all the crates, but you know, it's just a warm-up level, right? I'm just trying to get a hang of what this game is again. After fumbling through a few levels, something kind of weird oh. happened. <gasps> oh! Where's my gem? Where's my gem? Doesn't it appear here? What? I don't have a gem. No. So much if you have to do the whole thing again. <laughs> oh, you can't die for that gem. Oh, that, well, that's okay then. That's, that's all right. Ah! Got you little bitch. But where do I hide? I'm not, he's just... It's like these nuts. This guy. What the fuck? So after a few more levels, beating Pinstripe. Finish him. Finish him. All right. It was time for me to face my demons. And by that, I mean the high road. Because I remember getting stuck at the high road, which is where we're at now. This is the level that made me quit in 2017. Five and a bit years ago, I quit on this level. And I know exactly why, because... It's annoying as shit. I've just got two lives, which I'm gonna lose instantly. See? You stay there. Just a warning, you're gonna see a lot of this in this video. Ah! Can't even get past the second goddamn bit, man. God damn. God damn. Yes! We are doing it. We are doing it. Whew. Nailed it. No! <gasps> I did. No! I did not how many times I died. Oh, no! no. Way. Nailed it. Okay. The level that made me quit all those years ago. I beat it. There's hope. Next was Slippery Climb. Fucking hell! How was that even possible to fall all the way down to there? Just beating the high road and this level feels like such an achievement because I know these are the gate levels that I was getting stuck on and I couldn't beat, so I feel like I've already achieved something, which is putting me in good stead. I'm not looking forward to doing that level again anytime soon, though. Alright, let's do this. Ooh. Ooh. Alright. Okay, okay. That was alright, that wasn't so bad. My first trophy in five years was in sight. All I had to do was beat Dr. Nitrous Brio. And he was alright, to be fair. Ah! Oh, I got you, son! Alright, come on. Come on, come to Platts. Oh my god. Oh my god. Five! Six! Damn it! Well played. Ah! And there is my first trophy. Nitrous Broken, my first trophy in Crash Bandicoot in over five years. My last trophy was December 2017, and now it is February 2023. We did it. 
I then managed another trophy minutes later. Ooh! I just got a trophy for a hidden gem pal. I don't really know what that means, but I'm gonna take it. All I had left was Cortex to finally beat the game after all this time. I was sick of seeing this annoying game over screen. God damn. So Emily advised me that you can rack up a good 10 lives by just playing half the Lost City level. No! But, nailed it. I'm still going. This seemed to be a massive struggle for me. Can we do it for you? No! I got this, man! Lost it. Yes, boss. Oh, hello. Just hacked Unsurprisingly, it. Emily was getting a little bit annoyed with my Ooh. snide remarks. <laughs> <laughs> well. So Last one. Okay. I'm going to struggle here, aren't I? No! Oh! Is that it? Oh, is there a second? Oh, it's done! Cortex N. Cortex N capacitated. Oh my god. Oh, a little cutscene. Ah, oh, he got the girl. Crash got the girl. Happy days, Crash. He's getting summer night. And now, that was the easiest part of the game over. Now, all I can see in my future of playing this game is nothing but frustration, anger, tears and depression. With the main game over, I had three things to do. Get the two keys, get all the gems for each level, this is for collecting all the boxes, some without dying, finally all the speed trials. The keys were first, and they were easy. And there it is, Cortex's craze contest. And there we have the trophy, Cortex's terrifying trial. Well, we all know what's left now. Now it's time for the hardest part of the game, the gems and speed relics. You require gold relics on every level for the speedrun trophy. Strap yourselves in, this part may be a while. This guy. Oh, Lewis, no. Ah. I start off on the easy level, hog wild. Easy probably isn't the best turn. Aha! I got myself the first gem of the run. Now for the speed relic. <laughs> Yes, did it. Right, so how's that time stand? Oh, gold relic. Okay, got a gold relic. It only took about five attempts. <sighs> so the next port of call is boulders. Turns out I already have the gem for this, so I'm going to have to just go straight in for the time trial. Uh, 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 this is the first good attempt, to be fair. Uh, nail it, nail it, nail it, nail it, nail it. Oh, I did it. Ooh. I bloody well did it. Oh, gold relic. First try for boulders. I'ma take that. <laughs> no, Lewis, you fool! Six, seven. Oh, fudge. Saved it. I've done it again. Where are these two other boxes? <gasps> Hell yeah. I was so close to the end. Oh, I was two seconds too slow. Two seconds too slow. Man, come on, it's there, it's there, it's there. 20 seconds. Oh, that's it. Gold. Oh. Can't remember to start that run. What about you? But I think I'll restart that one. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. I'm going to park on Sunset Vista. That's annoying me too much. This is going to have to be a relic for another time, I think. Got a lot of lives. And there's the gem. Oh, fuck. Gonna die. Oh, I'm going. I'm going. No! Ah, God's sake. Right! Why am I so stupid? Oh, I'm gonna get that one. Oh, ah, God's sake. Did I even get a colour there? Oh, I got a trophy! Five relics. It don't have to be platinum. I got a, sil I got a silver relic. Oh, I'll, I'll take it. No! I got so close! Might still make it, might still make it. What do I need? 157. Yeah, yeah. I think I did it. Oh, I've done it. Yes! Nice. Nailed it.
Well. Oh, god damn. Oh, god. I didn't make it again. Fucking thank you. I'm jumping way too early for these. Lewis, just run no fucking post, man. Ah. Oh. My god, this jump is making me want to jump off a fucking cliff. Well, I finished level. And I got a gem. Nice. I finished the level. 27 seconds. I've done it. It's the only time I've actually managed to finish it. What we're we looking at. Gold relic. Thank God. When I did the gem, I was like, I can't, I'm going to make a video. I'm going to talk about how I'm really feeling really confident. Now I'm not feeling confident at all. This is like an easy level. I've got six, seven relics now. I've got now 20 to go, and they're only going to get harder. So, yeah, I'm in for a ride. Thankfully, not every level in this game caused me soul-crushing pain. I managed to bash through a few and pick up a few trophies, firstly for 10 total relics and for the 13 gems. I must have been half asleep at this point because I forgot to record any of the footage, so just pretend there's footage of me earning these trophies. I just want to jump in here and quickly say thanks for watching the video so far. Some of the levels coming up pushed me to a level of anger and frustration I did not know was even possible. And I want your help. I'm trying to decide if this is going to be my last ever Crash Bandicoot game I play in Platinum, or whether I should complete the trilogy and go for Crash Bandicoot 2. So I'll leave it in your hands. If this video gets 1000 likes, I will Platinum Crash Bandicoot 2. Not only that, I'll do a giveaway, something relating to Crash Bandicoot. Alright, let the infuriating grind continue. Oh fuck. Oh, fucking thing as well. oh, shit. Right. Fuck this. Nah, I'm not doing this one right now. Okay, so this is where I'm at right now. It's uh, it's just like gone midnight on a Sunday night and I'm up at work in like six and a half hours. But I set myself a goal of 18 gems and 18 relics for today. I've only got six levels left and all of them are not easy levels now. And now I'm very much at the st sticking point. I, th I feel like this is where most people start to give up because all the levels left are brutally hard. So I'm gonna try Lights Out. It's probably the easiest of the ones I have left, but it still is a ball ache. Oh, the level's over? Oh, when you do the gem path, the level's like shortened? Have I finished the level? No way. I'ma take that. Oh, I almost fell there. I was inches away from perishing. And we all know inch, an inch is, is a lot, a big amount. All right, apparently going up here and we should just finish the level. Apparently you don't need to do the rest of the level for the actual speed trial, which is nifty. It is nifty, look at that. So I didn't, I got the gold there, yeah. You needed 120 for gold, I got 13 seconds faster and the platinum was 104. Six, I think the platinum is 106. 0 0.03 away from getting the, the platinum relic there. Nice. That was so easy. So easy. Oh, you fucking little bitch. Oh, almost got the sea bomb there. Oh, there it is. Gem. Thank God for that, everybody. No swear words this time. No swear words. Oh, you bitch. Oh, you bitch. Oh, God. What am I doing? I was playing Crash on 8 hours on this day, and it was getting so late on the Sunday, and I was getting so tired and so frustrated. And then I sat down, and this happened. Thankfully, with my one good eye, I managed to beat this relic. Run! 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 That's it! That's it! Is that it? Yes! Ah, oh, gold relic. That one took... Way too long. 17. Okay, right, but this gem path must take us to where we gotta go. There's more of a level. What? <laughs> Lewis, you absolute bloody mug. Oh, I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get the trophy. For 99 lives. What a good way to end the day. On cloud nine trophy. That's what you want. I'm gonna get the relic. Not the relic. I'm gonna get the gem as well. And there's the gem as well. That is, that is excellent. Oh, the Lost City. Or oh, Slippery Climb, I have to do now. I need a Lost City again, Em. That's easy on me. That's easy on me. Right. Oh. Oh, no! Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck, no! 
No, is that the end, Emily? Oh, is that the end? The lizard! The lizard! Again! Okay. It's on my head. Spin! Oh! Yes! And I've done it! Oh! Fuck you, lizards. Um, and I'm just using this warmth to try and muster some sort of energy because I only have four left now, four relics left. And I have to do the high road and slippery climb. And when I beat the gem for slippery climb, I unlock the two easier levels. And I think it's time to face the high road. The level that made me quit five years ago. I need to try and now get the relic and the gem. If I saw one of these turtles drowning in the river, I would, um, I would enjoy it. Do turtles drown? I have no idea. Checkpoint again. If I saw a turtle off a beach. If, oh yeah, it's a tortoise. If I saw this tortoise drowning, I would um I would have great pleasure. Oh, I've done it! That only took me like five attempts. After the 30 deaths at the start. But once I got past the deaths, actually it was actually okay, surprisingly. Oh you can! The rope! The rope! Oh shit! Oh, I've made it, I've made it. Oh! 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 Is that it? Is that it? Time, 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 time! Time, time! Oh! S Sapphire! No! Seven seconds too slow, man. Ah! 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 ah. Still too slow. I've done it as well, I'm too slow again. No, I didn't. Oh, I did it! Gold! It's done! I did it! Yes. Oh. So. Alright, so this is where we're at. We've got one gem left. Just the one. Two relics left. I've got to do a road nowhere. Gonna get me that gem, get me that sweet plat, and then get me the relic. Why you do this? Why you do this to me, world? Oh no, I don't! And there's the gem. And there is the sweet old gem. We got it. Now, that's the last gem of the game. Ultimate gem path for an ultimate person. Yeah. Okay, one relic remains between me and that sweet platinum. I feel like I put my time in. All right, I've been at this a while. Slippery climb, and the platinum is 2 minutes 26. So I think I can make a few mistakes. I just have to keep going. Ultimately, I have to finish the level without dying, first and foremost, and just try not to make too many mistakes. It's time. Ah, oh. the beginning shouldn't be this hard. You have to. Oh, I'm too impatient. I can't even wait like a second for that bloody platform to come to me. Is this almost over yet? Or oh, I've done it! <gasps> Give me it! Give me it! Give me it! There we go, bro. Congratulations, bro. The platform crash is done. Ah, uh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Crowd goes wild. Dex goes wild. Emily goes wild. <laughs> now, do I do Stormy Ascent? Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, I fucking ruined it. I fucked it. I fucked it. I was too. I was too. Too scared. Oh, you fucking... No. Aha! Uh -huh. Give me the goddamn gem and let me be done with this goddamn gem. That took me about 70 lives to do just the gem, for the record. And there's the crown jewel trophy. And I just feel hollow inside after doing that. I've decided I'm done. I am calling quits on it. I probably could do Stormy Ascent if I spent 10, 12 hours working on this level, but quite frankly, I've had my time with Crash feels like it's coming to an end. I just feel like I'm done with the game. I feel like I've got no energy left to push through this. It's been really difficult. It's a tough, tough platformer game, and I feel like the Platinum is enough of an achievement to say I've done it, I've beat it, and I'm, I'm happy with just saying, you know, enough's enough. I can return to it whenever I want. But right now, I am I'm done with Crash. Um, it's been a good show, Crash, but 
you annoyed the shit out of me. And I don't have the strength for another 10 hours for one level. I ain't got it in me. Not right now, anyway. This Platinum was really hard and it pushed me, but it isn't the hardest I've beat. If you want to see that, check out my Marvel vs. Capcom video. It was brutal. Or if you want a cheeky lol, check out my Chivalry 2 video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like to see me play Crash 2. Bye!